Breaking news this afternoon, the chairman of Samsung Group, Lee Gun Hee, has died at the age of 78. His family, including his son and heir, Lee Jae Yong, were reportedly by his side. On the line with the details is our Kim Myung Sung. Tell us a bit more about the late Lee Gun Hee. Well, Devin, let me start off by telling you that this man will not be easily forgotten. As chairman, he grew Samsung into South Korea's biggest conglomerate and one of the top electronics companies in the world. Under his leadership, Samsung became the world's largest maker of memory chips in the early 90s, and by 2012, it was number one in the mobile industry. In his career, in his career, Lee Gun Hee was convicted twice of white-collar crimes like bribery and tax evasion, though he was pardoned both times. Six years ago, he had a heart attack and has since been in the hospital with a number of chronic ailments. He died Sunday morning at Seoul Samsung Hospital. By his side were his family, including his son and heir Lee Jae Yong, who is vice chairman of Samsung Electronics. As for the funeral, there will be a small family service. As for the wishes of the late Lee Gun Hee and the family, that's all I have for now. But there will be an update at six. Back to you, Devin. All right, thank you, Kim Yun Sung. There reporting.